It is time. <laughs> Finally, my masterpiece is finished. P. No, I know what you are thinking. Callie, what is that? Well, what is it? This, ladies and gentlemen, is the brand new Mr. P design. And that is a Mr. P dancing. Oh yeah, ladies and gentlemen, I am dancing in the brand new converted carnival. So what we're gonna be doing today is checking out this map to see exactly how good it is. There is a wall of YouTubers here too with a couple of people who have played already, including this guy who I've seen before. Sh shout outs to you, Le Lego man. But anyways, I thought we should give this game a go to see how the brand new chapter eight is going to look. And as you guys can see right now, it actually looks pretty pretty good. I mean, they've changed all the outside to the brand new purple color. They have what seems to be a clowny in the background and I don't want to go near him just in case he tries to kill us. But apart from that, I don't think there's much more else changed. So let's play this map and let's find out what has been changed. So apart from the fact I am an incredibly handsome Mr. P who literally has his own walking animation, I have no idea or inkling of what I'm supposed to do. Wait, oh, oh, oh no. Is the game broke already? Hello? There we go. Okay, we managed to get it. I was super confused. Also, I can collect as many keys as I want at once, which is uh, super helpful. Ple please stop bugging inside of there. A yellow key as well. There is literally so many keys in the beginning. Okay, so I have the red key right here. So let's uh, unlock this one right here. And come on. Do it. <laughs> what? What is that? Oh, I'm actually stuck. This is so embarrassing. I can't believe I'm stuck already. Stop it. I really want to get inside. P please work. Oh, please, Key. I really want you to work. It's because he has this stick thing. It makes everything glitch. Okay, you know what? We're going to leave that one for a minute. And we'll probably come back to that one in a little while. As for now, let's see if there is a key hiding inside of this vault over here. Okay, we need the yellow key. Hopefully, this one works. There we go. And I got a hammer, which I'm hoping means I can bonk that silly little goose over in the corner on the head. That's right. Oh, yep. The door has pushed me. <laughs> the door pushed me over. Get out of my way, door. This is my beautiful carnival. I'm actually a little bit scared to go near him. What are you looking at, buddy? What are you looking at? Okay, uh, I'm actually a little bit scared to go too close, but I'm going to use my hammer right now. And let's see what we get. Okay, we got an actual hammer. That was just a mallet? What? Okay. I don't even remember if that was a thing or not. Okay, is he coming after me now? Oh, Clowny, please. I'll up your wages. <laughs> I promise. Stop chasing me. Oh, I nearly just got trapped. Wait, can I let him out? I do have the orange key. Is it going to glitch me? Oh, it's going to glitch me. Sir, please leave me alone. Please. I, I don't... Wait, a battery? Let's grab that battery. No, no, no. Oh, oh my goodness. I... Oh, are you... <laughs> Are you kidding me? Okay, well, even though we didn't do too good the first time, I have a feeling now we know everything is. We're gonna do much better this time. Clowny, what are you doing? I thought we were friends now. No, this is gonna be impossible. I'm just gonna die every single time. Oh, I'm stuck in the ground. I am stuck. I am stuck. Oh, no. Okay, let's see if we can get this guy stuck inside of a room right now. I have to be honest. If we can get him stuck somewhere... Then that might be our, our cheat code to getting this map finished. So let's come inside of here and go like that. Oh, no! I got stuck myself. Seriously? Okay, well, here we go. It looks like he's stuck inside of there. So now we can literally go and grab everything else and get ourselves the next part of the map unlocked. Now, I have a feeling we might have to use the red key on the other side because it's not working on this side. Oh, no, I can hear Clowny again. Clowny, stay away from me, please. Please stay away from me. Come on. Yes! The red one has been opened. Oh, my goodness. What? Stay away. Oh, what? <laughs> it bounced me off. Oh, my goodness. Okay, let's try that again. Okay, it literally won't let me go up there. And now I'm dead. How can you literally kill me whilst I'm wearing this amazing outfit? Seriously, I'm actually getting kind of mad. This guy needs to just stay away from me. Yay! Oh, I couldn't grab it in time. Let's grab this piece of wood instead. Okay, well, I just realized we need the hammer for this, so I'm gonna use the hammer to take this off if I can. There we go. Now we just need the spanner, the white key, and the key code, and we will have completed this map. So there's battery number two. We need an orange key. Didn't I have that earlier? 
I I'm pretty sure I did. Let let's go back and see if it's there. And uh, here we go. There it is. Let's grab the orange key. Let's free that beautiful little man inside of that room right there without getting killed by Clowny, who seems to be stuck over there at the minute. You know what? I'm going to go around the other way. This way is totally broken and it's not acceptable to be honest so let's come around here and use our orange key come on. yes i freed you i'm just gonna go past you and grab the spanner thank you so much sir okay now do we want to go over to Clowny or do we want to try and find something else? <laughs> what I do need to do, though, is find out where I'm supposed to be putting uh, the batteries. Because so far, I've not seen a single place to put them. There's also another battery up here. So I know that we need two batteries. <gasps> oh, I remember. We have to put the batteries on this ride over here. I'm pretty sure that's what we have to do, right? So let's find ourselves a blue key. Oh, no. Is he going to get me? Okay, I think we might be safe. L let's just look around for the blue key and try and remember where I found it. Oh, okay, we found it literally inside of the cafeteria. Let's grab this bad boy right now. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, let's go right now and see if we can use this key without getting caught by Clowny. That's right. The key needs to be used on the other side of the map, and I am going to be the one to use it. Trust me, sir. You are not going to stop me because I'm biggest. Yeah, flipping Randy. That's right. Let's let's open this up. Hopefully, it works this side. Oh, no. Oh, no. Please don't tell me I have to use it on the other side. He's gonna get me, isn't he? Okay, is he, is he gonna get me? Is he? Okay. I think we're totally safe right now. Let's come up here and use our wrench. Just like, uh, Oh, there we go. And now we get the key code, but where are we supposed to use the batteries? I don't remember where we're supposed to use the batteries. Are we supposed to use... Wait. Did, did, did Foxy come out of the cage? Is he supposed to be able to do that? Hmm. <laughs> I'm a bit confused. Okay, I don't know what just happened, but my recording decided to stop, and so I did get killed by Clowny. I mean, we now need to go get everything that we already had. So let's go and find that right now, hopefully without Clowny killing us. And let's complete this map. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is grab myself the battery from up here. Because now I know where this goes, I kind of want to see what happens if we do it. Plus, you can't get me up here. <laughs> That's right, stupid. Oh, okay, I was wrong. I was definitely wrong. <laughs> okay, okay, I think we might be safe again for a little while. It looks like we've stopped being chased. So let's put our batteries in, one and two. And Oh, wait, that gives us the white key. I thought we had the white key already. Are you kidding me? Which means the code is up here. And now we have everything to complete this game now. This is where things are going to get hard. Because obviously, guys, we can't just get past this guy. Because he's a flipping Randy and won't just let us win the game. So we're going to have to try and be quite strategical about how we do this. Okay, come on. No! Are you kidding me? Okay, and now finally, we need to go over here. And oh, I can't get through there. I definitely can't poke through there, ladies and gentlemen. So what I need to do is go into Foxy's cage and grab myself the wrench without getting killed like that and then we can simply go over and do the next part of the puzzle but we still have one huge problem and that is that we can't open this door because we cannot do this stupid wrench there we go here we go come on yes oh my goodness i still beat you to it cloudy that's right and that is just over here so let's grab that by sliding through and just hippity hoppity your key is now my property now if everything goes okay here we should should be able to stick this key straight in. Come on. No! Okay, so I think I actually have a pretty good idea that I'm going to try to do. If I can get this guy to follow me all the way to the other side of the map and let him kill me there, he will be waiting right over there so that when I come next time, I can grab the key and go straight towards the door. I know. I'm a genius. Let's go over here right now. Let's get killed. Is he following me? Come on, clowny. That's right. Who's the clown now, punk? That's right. When you kill me in this corner, you're flipping Randy. I will be smarter than you. That's right. Yeah, I'm dead. I'm dead. But you, sir, are stupid. Because now you're all the way over there. This gives me a totally longer amount of time to be able to put this key inside of that door. So let's get over there, Mission Impossible style. And let's stick it in the door and finally complete the brand new carnival map. If I can just... There we go. What? The winner's room. I don't know. This seems a bit fishy to me, like a trap. Do I go inside? Okay, let's go inside and let's see what happens. Wait, are you kidding me? Wait, what is happening? Oh, I'm glowing. I'm a glowing potato. What is this? A winner's room. Sabrina Bright. And there's some morphs here. There's a mini tune locked up in a cage. 
Wait, why is it just Sabrina Bright? That's kind of weird, I guess. But anyways, let's see this. Play Pong? <gasps> no. I'm so good at I'm so good at this game. What color am I? Am I blue? Okay, I'm definitely blue. Oh, you suck! You suck so bad. Okay, wait. Oh, it's just me playing against myself, isn't it? I'm so stupid. What is this? Oh, <gasps> no. Don't tell me this is like a Minecraft minecart. Okay, it doesn't work. Oh, that's so Oh! It works! Oh! <laughs> why couldn't they add this into the actual game? That would be so epic! Oh, that's probably why, because it's broken. Is that the respawn? Yep, there it is. Okay, let's not do that again. <laughs> Oops. But yes, guys, that is going to be it from me today. If you guys did enjoy this video, then please do hit the subscribe button. What are you waiting for? As you guys can see, there's two videos on the screen right now. This one is an oldie. This one is a goldie. Again, guys, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you all in the next video. Goodbye!